Hi, and welcome to my quick guide of the quest Plague City. There are no quest or stats requirements, and the items needed are a dwellberry, a rope, four buckets of water, a bucket of milk, chocolate dust, and a snape grass. For the recommended items, as always, some weight reducing armor and one stamina potion should be enough. And for the teleports, none, but I will be bringing along one after the quest is completed. Now before we're going to start the quest, I'm going to quickly grab this spade as well as going inside of the house and grab that picture. Next, let's go outside to the garden and talk to Edmund and select option 1 and 2. After we've spoken to him, we will need to speak with his wife, who's either in the living room or located just outside east. Let's talk to Alrina, and we should get the gas mask. Next, we will need to return to Edmund, so he will talk to us about the loose soil. Next, let's go two squares east of the bucket spawn, and there we should find some mud patch. Let's click on your buckets and use all four of them on the one soil patch, mud patch. Once all four are down, let's stand on the tile and dig with your spade until it crumbles away. Next, go south and go to the pipe. Turn your camera north and right click on that grill or pipe and try to open it. And you can't pull it off alone. Next, use your rope on the grill, not on the pipe, but on the grill. So you can lay it out and next let's go north and talk to Edmund. So so we can start the cutscene. Next, let's equip our gas mask and go through the pipe. After we've climbed through the pipe, let's go a little bit east and we'll need to talk to an NPC with grey hair and a green pants called Chet Hick. Talk to him and select option 1 twice. Next, go north, go around the big building and keep going north. You may drop the buckets, you don't need them anymore, as well as a spade. Try to open this wooden shack's door. And he will let you enter. Next, talk to Ted or Martha, doesn't matter. Then go upstairs and talk to the little girl called Millie. After you've spoken to her, let's go outside. I will now need to go to the southern wall. So just keep running south until you hit the southern wall. We will need to go to the building with the two big X's on the door, which is located slightly southeast of the big church. Once we're here, try to open any of the two doors with the big X on it and select option 1 and then 2. Next, we will need to go north. We will need to get some clearance, so therefore we will need to go to the big building on the town square. Go through the big doors and talk to the clerk. Select option 2 and then 1. Next, go through the southeastern door and talk to Breivik and select option 1 and then 3. Next, use your chocolate dust on the bucket of milk and then use your snape grass on the chocolate milk and then use the hangover cure on Breivik and then select option 3. Next, go through the door and go back south to the building with the two big X's on the doors.
let's go through the door. Once we've gone through the door, go stand west of the staircase and you'll find a barrel. Search it for a key and then go down the spooky stairs. Open the door and talk to Elena. Next, once she is gone, let's go back upstairs and go back to the town square to go through the manhole and talk to Edmund to complete our quest. And congratulations, you've completed Plague City Quest. You are awarded with one quest point, the ability to cast East Ardoin Teleport spell, and 2425 mining experience. Be sure to read the magic scroll so it can disappear, and then you can drop everything else in your inventory. This was my quick guide how to complete Plague City Quest. Hopefully it helped. Subscribe, rate, and comment. Okay, thanks, bye.